Oracle recently announced Oracle Mobile Suite, a new component of Fusion middleware. In this video, you'll get insight on the mobility market and Oracle's mobile strategy. You will learn about the components of Oracle Mobile Suite and the productivity they can bring to your team. You'll also see a case study highlighting how Mobile Suite can make your backend more agile to support mobile applications. Mobile, cloud, two terms that are dominating the thoughts of global IT organizations. With the cloud, customers can easily provision applications, platforms, and infrastructure to scale out their business. When they think about delivering applications to end users, organizations are now starting to think about mobile first. Mobile users have different expectations than web users. You need to understand not only what they want to do, but when they will do it and where they will be. You need to think beyond the office, beyond business hours. This is enterprise mobilization. But while it's the polished UI and social networking features that your users see, what they don't see is the back end. Not only do they not see it, they simply don't care. They don't, but you do. Let's face it, the best mobile application in the world is useless if your back end is not up to the task. To run enterprise mobile applications on mobile devices, either corporate phones and tablets or bring your own device private devices, data accessibility, integration, integrity, and confidentiality are essential. This results in increased requirements for your back end. Prominent analyst firms have even found that most of the complexity and cost of mobile deployments come from the back end. Thus, you'll need infrastructure in middleware that will help you streamline operations and keep costs under control while fulfilling technical and functional requirements. Getting the back end right is one thing, but this is not always enough to fulfill the requirements of your users. All around the world, business executives, middle managers, and end users expect more from their IT tools. They get ideas for new features and requirements from the mobile applications and online services they use day to day. In parallel, they want to capitalize on the opportunities offered by new communication channels created by social networking. IT is not just about the internal processes of the organization anymore, but pervades all aspects of its activities. Moreover, new technologies, when they appear, never completely replace what was there before. Each successive technology wave rather adds to the organization's IT architecture. Today's IT departments thus have to manage mobile applications on top of the legacy and web applications they already had and need to maintain a SOA-based infrastructure at the same time. Needless to say, the headcount doesn't necessarily grow proportionally. Moreover, the mobile space is fragmented. Android and iOS, the two dominant operating systems, are built on very different architectures. Sharing code between the two is not possible unless you use cross-platform technologies such as HTML5. In other words, application needs grow at an exponential pace. On the other hand, financial pressures on operating budgets mean that development resources grow at best linearly. Oracle calls this growing shortfall in development resources the development gap. The development gap is something that's very real and it's unfortunately here to stay. There are really only two things that you can do in order to try and bridge that. The first is by having a much more productive mobile development tool that's going to meet your user expectations but also reduce the time that it takes to market as well. The second is by having a much more agile backend, one which will enable you to leverage the investments that you already have, as well as encapsulating complexities. Therefore, you're able to take advantage of the cost efficiencies that you have in cloud when and where it makes sense. And you can migrate applications or start moving to a SaaS solution on a case by case basis as you require. The road to mobile is rife with challenges. Oracle Mobile Suite is your solution for end to end mobile application development from devices to enterprise services. Oracle Mobile Suite combines the productivity of Oracle ADF Mobile for developing on-device native applications with the agility of Oracle Service Bus and the extensive connectivity brought by Oracle integration adapters. 
It enables you to transform existing point-to-point -point services and heterogeneous data sources into simplified service interfaces optimized for mobile application access. Oracle Mobile Suite is part of a wider strategic initiative called Oracle Mobile Platform. Let's hear from Suhas Uliar, Vice President of Mobile Strategy and Product Management. The Oracle Mobile Strategy is to simplify enterprise mobility by giving our customers a complete mobile solution, yet still giving organizations the choice and flexibility to build their own unique mobile strategy. So the Oracle strategy consists of three key components, Oracle Mobile Apps, the Oracle Mobile Platform, and Oracle Mobile Security. The Oracle provides platform with a completely integrated security that can be used with the platform or standalone to build your own mobile apps. At the same time, Oracle has many mobile applications integrated to Oracle apps that customers can use as a starting point. All of these apps built on a common platform. So with Oracle Mobile Solution, enterprises have a complete holistic solution that they can use to mobilize their enterprise, their B2C applications, as well as their business-to-business -business applications. You probably have many applications from a variety of suppliers. Those applications are the core of your business. They have a direct impact on your revenues and profits. Mobile applications will not replace them, but rather use them as a foundation. On the other hand, to be effective in the mobile space means moving at consumer speed and adapt to quick technology shifts. Thus, your backend needs to become more agile. The key to achieving such agility are consolidation, integration, and simplification. Oracle Service Bus is bundled with all the adapters you need in order to create mobile services on top of your current systems. This is one of the reasons why Oracle has been consistently recognized as belonging to the leaders quadrant by industry analysts. The adapters cover three main categories. Packaged applications, such as Oracle eBusiness Suite. Legacy and mainframe technologies, such as Oracle Tuxedo. Technologies and protocols like JMS and FTP. With Oracle Mobile Suite, your current IT assets can be the pillars of your mobile strategy. Both you and the users of your mobile applications must be sure that the confidentiality, integrity, and availability of all the data will be preserved at all times. Oracle Mobile Suite has all the features needed to handle this, notably robust encryption for the databases and credentials stored on the mobile devices, transport and message level security, access control policies on service endpoint. For years, Oracle Identity Management Solutions have been recognized as market leading by analyst firms. Oracle Mobile Suite fully integrates with those solutions ADF Mobile offers an optimal mix of productivity and flexibility. It is based upon the same design principles found in Java Enterprise Edition and Oracle ADF. Its main features are Build once, run on iOS and Android. Whether it's on a tablet or phones, your code will run unchanged since it runs on a Java virtual machine. User interface rendered in HTML5 and JavaScript built with Oracle's extensive component library, or use HTML5 and JavaScript directly. A local relational database, fully ACID compliant, that can be encrypted. Full access to native device features. You can take photos, track location using the onboard GPS, send email and SMS, among other things. Application components are modular and reusable, this improves quality while reducing time to market significantly. ADF Mobile increases developers' productivity by offering a very visual and a declarative development approach. You have a set of over 60 user interface components simplifying the UI definition and providing native-like UX such as touch gestures and animation all out of the box. Connecting these user interfaces to server-based services local Java classes and device services is done in a very declarative way using a very powerful binding layer to abstract away the low-level communication protocols. And when it comes to writing on-device business logic, 
you use Java or JavaScript or HTML. In fact, Oracle ADF Mobile is the only solution in the market which enables Java developers to use the language that they already know. In addition, the de design philosophy that we use behind ADF Mobile is very similar to GSF. So basically any Java web developer will be able to pick it up pretty quickly. While you may be adopting a mobile-first approach now, chances are your backend wasn't specifically designed with the peculiarities of mobile in mind. Fortunately, Oracle Service Bus enables you to hide complexity and provide the opportunity to both simplify and enrich the information exchanged with mobile clients in a format optimized for them. Oracle Enterprise Service Bus delivers a standards-based service integration for high-volume mission-critical environments spanning the enterprise and the cloud. It also offers intelligent load balancing and a built-in high-availability infrastructure, which will ensure the kind of responsiveness mobile users expect. Its strong support for RESTful web services make it an ideal complement to mobile applications, especially since its integration capabilities are configuration-driven, which reduces downtime and complexity. This explains why over the years, Oracle's SOA middleware garnered numerous accolades. Industry analysts now recognize it as market-leading, in no small part because of Oracle Service Bus. So there are basically three things that a bus can do for you. It can route messages to the correct destination, it can even be used for load balancing. It can be used to transform data from one format to another. So if your formats change, you only need to change the bus. And you can expose light and very responsive services suited for consumption by mobile devices without having to retrofit your legacy systems. It also supports multiple protocols and this can be used very importantly to help keep legacy platforms still very relevant. And all of this basically means that your mobile applications only see the service bus. And you can either move your back-end services elsewhere, for example to the cloud, or you can replace implementations by another, for example EBS, going to Fusion ERP. And this can all be done in a very transparent fashion. Here's a small example to illustrate the flexibility that Oracle Mobile Suite will bring to your organization. Let's take a fictitious mobile employee management application. This application communicates with the back end through a RESTful web service. The data is encoded in the JSON format. The URI to access the REST resource is forward slash employee. To access a specific record, one simply adds the employee ID at the end. The service, as you may suspect, is defined on Oracle Enterprise Service Bus. In OSB parlance, it is what we call a proxy service. When a request arrives, the proxy passes it to a data conversion step where we extract the employee ID and store it in a variable. Then, we build an appropriate XML request and call an internal SOAP service to fetch the details of the employee. Currently, this web service is provided by a legacy HR system. The name of the method is getEmp. The results of the service are processed by the bus and transformed from XML to JSON before being sent back to the mobile device. Now, suppose we implement a new HR system. This system also offers web services to access employee data, but the names for the method and its parameter are different as is the data format. Fortunately, the solution has been implemented over a service bus.
Basically, the only things we need to change in the message flow, a part of the switch from one service to another, are the data conversions. In this case, this can be done in a matter of minutes. Productive Standards-based Compatible Agile A single platform for B2B, B2C, and B2E. This is Oracle Mobile Suite. Oracle bring enterprise to your mobile device. Here are a few learning resources to help you learn more about the components of Oracle Mobile Suite. ADF Academy offers a free online interactive course titled Developing Applications with ADF Mobile. Built by professional educators, it will teach you the basics of ADF Mobile in a concise and structured fashion. There is a comprehensive repository of samples dedicated to Oracle Enterprise Service Bus. You can also find their video recordings teaching key concepts and techniques. For more information on Oracle's mobile strategy, please go to oracle.com mobile.